Right, if you get arrested for using your free speech, whether you're responsible or not, the fact that you've been arrested for exercising your free speech means that you should be gotten out of jail for free. It also means that you should be represented for free. Now, that doesn't mean that you get represented or gotten out of jail for anything. Certainly, if you uh, are using drugs, if you're creating some violence, if you, if you have some other problem, this isn't the place to do it. And I'm not going to be representing you for that. All right. Um, even if you're not doing anything wrong, there's a possibility that you could get arrested. Just like uh, several of those people in New York who were just sitting, standing there on the sidewalk. It's possible that you could be yanked out and be arrested. Francis, yes. Uh, to, be, to be fair, this, this isn't exactly a report back. This is very informative. Uh, but this section of the meeting is strictly for things that have already happened. So thank you, Francis. Okay. Um, and we can maybe add this to the agenda. That's good. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Sarah? Um, yeah, hi guys. Uh, my name is Sarah. Um, and I'm on the diversity committee, but I just wanted to make a general announcement. Um, Danny here and I are kind of heading up um, access for um, people with disabilities, any kind of disability. So if at any point um, during this meeting or as the occupation progresses, you have some sort of access need, um, or something that you want to make sure um, is, is dealt with so that this can be as inclusive of a movement as possible, um, I would encourage you to contact one of us. Um, for the sake of easiness of email, I'll give you Danny's email and we'll just kind of share. His email is dysc45 at gmail.com. Um, and yeah, we want everybody to be able to participate. So don't let anything stop you. Right.